Hey everybody and welcome ah oh, welcome back to Spelunky. When we last left off, I I got to the ice no the temple in fact and died thanks to throwing a bomb at my own head. Which is you know it's my fault. I can't can't blame the game. I blame the game for so much and to be honest that's probably for good reason. But uh, the way I died was entirely my fault. I faced the wrong way, threw a bomb at the place I should have been running at, and then blew myself up. Today we shall have none of those mistakes. Today we are going to finish this game. I know I say that every single time, but I have. No, I'm not going to say I have a good feeling. I'm not going to say I have a good feeling at all. Right, let's grab this over here. Ah, that skellywag was awake. I saw him popping up. Right. Let's get this crate in here. And then... Oh, I fell off. Right, that crate had some bombs in it. That's pretty nice. Had a spider in it. That's not so nice. Right, we are almost at our 10k limit. These chests should perhaps put us over that. Yeah. Nice. Drop down a bit more money. Spider eco here. That's some nice stuff over there, but... I'm not going to waste time getting into it. Like that though. Let's move through. So we are 35% uh, ahead of where we should be. Bombs are up. We're up the same. Health is fine. We have a shop with some bombs in it. We'll take those straight off the bat. Ah, I was thinking about getting spike shoes, but. Oh, come on. That was terrible. Oh. No. Oh. Yeah, I threw a rock uh, across instead of down because I'm just like a massive. Noob. No, for a rock at my head then, because, you know, massive noob and stuff. Right, let's get into this place, which has... I think I'm going to let that gem get crushed. I'm not going to bomb this area just for one gem. I think I can't get out now. I think I didn't push that brick far enough. Anyway, in here we have... Oh, stupid. I'll take it just so I can throw it away. I hate this thing. Okay, we are safe to get out of that. Uh, this will serve as my rock. This is like an expensive rock. I can throw this at arrow traps and stuff. Got a giant spider up there. Should we kill him? We could. Could we? No. No, we could not. We could not kill that guy. It has to be a, another... Oh, I'm trying to go for a trick shot then. It has to be another run, doesn't it? I can't let a level two, two minute run, run go out. I'm, I'm so sorry. I've, I've admitted on many occasions I'm bad at this game. Oh, this is gonna suck. I was doing so good. I had bombs and stuff. And then I missed a pot right in front of my fish. What is wrong with me today? Yeah, go run them. Right, so my plans for today, after recording Spelunky, is I'm going to get a bunch of... Ooh, Dark Side is recorded. Uh, I've got enough to last me, I think, until tomorrow. I would have had it until the next day, but unfortunately uh, I lost an episode. If you watch Dark Side, you know it's because the HDPVR uh, crashed, so I lost my footage, which is a pain. But, you know, it's the first crash in a long time, so I'm not... Overly fuss, it's like it's a regular occurrence like it used to be. Oh, fudge. This is not proving to be a good run. Uh, yeah, my HPVI used to overheat all the time. We used to, when me and Mark used to record Drunken Minecraft. Get back here! After every recording episode, we would um, blast the HPVI out with my tower fan for a good 10 minutes before we resumed recording because it would overheat that much. Uh, moving through, health is very low, bombs are fine, rups are fine, money is fine. Um, and that was then, but now I have since discovered a way of stopping it from overheating. Yeah, let me down. So the first overheating thing in a long time is not going to be something I can complain about. Right, we need to get in there. Can we get in from below? I'm not going to risk it. Let's put a bomb down. Key. No, could not have gotten him from below. Ooh, I see a couple of crates down here. There's a lot of stuff in the shop that I want. 
Right, so we want to get into this, don't we? And we also want to get into there. Okay, that's that's good. That's like a staircase, a freeze gun, and some bombs. All right, I think we're gonna rob the black market without kill. I mean, rob the black, rob this shop without killing the shopkeeper. If I'm lucky, that is gonna be my plan. I'm gonna freeze him, take his bombs. And then run. Can you go into the exit for me, dog? No, dog. Stupid dog. Get in there. Right, I'm not sure if this plan will work, but if it does, it will get us lots of bombs and it might get us uh, the shopkeeper to forgive us before we get to the black market. I've mentioned before that. Uh, I think the shopkeeper will forgive you if you leave him alone after you've robbed him a little bit. And if we don't kill him, I think it decreases the amount of time we have to wait. So if we just freeze him, take his stuff and run, he might forgive us in two or three levels, but if we kill him, it might be like four or five levels. Alright, we need to get over there first. Jeez, I didn't figure out how far away it was. No! Get back. Can I freeze the giant spider? Let's have a look. Yes, doesn't kill him though. Right, let's move on down. Is this gonna hurt me? No, I landed on there, that's lucky. Oh, no. Phew. Right, so, if I pick this up and move it like to the door, move this to the door, move this the door and then move this all the way over here. I don't want that. And then just go. Huh. Please leave me alone. Right, the ghost is on his way. No, the shopkeeper's chasing me down. Uh, run, run, run. And we're through. Okay, we didn't kill him. He took no damage because the freezer gun doesn't hurt. So we may still have a bad guy, a bad guy, a shopkeeper waiting for us near the exit. But on the bright side, oh, there's a shopkeeper right there, isn't there? Right, he wants to kill me, I see it on his, uh, whatever it's called, wanted post that. But I also want to get down here. Phew. Oh no, shopkeep is on his way. Hey, get out of it. He's probably killed that dog now, hasn't he? Ah, get out. What's in there? Nothing. Listen, oh, oh, I fired the wrong way. Oh, snap. Right, let's try. I emphasize the word try. Getting into that exit without injuring him. This level appears to be very shy on money, either way of what's going to happen here. So it's a good job I did some robbing because I might not have been able to uh, get to the black market. Right, we're through. Now, if we're lucky, they might have forgiven us by now because we haven't injured them at all. It might take one more level though. We'll see, we'll see. Just got to hope that. Uh, I don't die in the meantime. Take that! If there's any shops around, we can always double check. Right, there's lots of cash money down there. There are tons of hidden red gems, which I guess I have the bombs to blast out now, but... Ah! Right, things to have to tell you, not that many. Really, the only thing I've got to mention is... Uh, you guys may remember... Ooh, sacrificial altar. Is there a dog nearby? That guy's still on the prowl, but that could be, mean anything. What was the thing? Oh yeah, you may remember when I ah, got <laughs> a bunch of copyright claims on my Halo videos. And that annoyed me because I do have permission for them. Well, they still haven't been removed. And as of this morning, I have even more. I don't think he can get out of there. And here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to drop the dog in. This may disarm him. This may... He may kill the dog. He may get straight into the exit. It is... Alright, we're through. We didn't even hit him. He should have forgiven us by now. Alright, we're in the jungle. Anyway, what was I saying? 
Um, copyright claims. Got even more Halo copyright claims, which is super annoying because I have permission. Oh, and yeah, so I wrote some emails to these companies. You son of a gun! Stating that what they're doing is uh, not just wrong, but it's also you know, illegal. They are committing copyright fraud. Uh, so I give them a stain, but reasonable letter asking them to remove their copyright claims their false copyright claims and as of now I still received no reply it's been almost a week but I guess I need to give them the benefit of the doubt you know maybe they need to send these emails to the correct departments and whatnot so I will ooh black market nearby I don't see Anything that could be the black market though. That is bombing in a downwardly direction. Yeah, so I'm going to give these guys a week or maybe two weeks to respond, and then if they don't, I shall call them up and have a direct rant. Ooh, some glasses. And if that doesn't work, oh snap. If that doesn't work, then uh, I guess there's no option but to take legal action, which is something I don't want to have to do. Right, the black market must be up here somewhere. Ha! Maybe down here? Can't imagine where else it would be. Oh, oh, oh! Down there? No, it's all the way over here. Look at this. It's quite well hidden, is this one? Right. That shopkeeper is still angry, which is disappointing, but I'm guessing maybe they'll forgive us. I'm hoping they'll forgive us once we're in the black market. We still don't have enough money, though, so we're going to have to rob them. I just want to have enough of a head start of them not hating me. Right, they don't hate me. Excellent. He's got his shotgun out. Doesn't say he hates me, though. No, he does! It's, an, oh, it's such a short episode. Before I got out of the mines. Thank you for watching. Tune in tomorrow. Goodbye.